in the implementation of a successful, successful innovative program and possibly assist the other implementation of that program at other institutions. I invite Michael Johnson to join me on stage to present the award winner. I hope you have a good story to share, Michael. <laughs> Actually, I also have a COVID story. <laughs> But our COVID story is actually the award. So um, if you go back two years, there were some professors teaching classes. And at that time, you may recall, that our classes all shut down. And all the students were sent home very, very suddenly in the coffee cups. We're still warm on the desks, literally. I remember the moment it happened. Uh, and we were all left figuring, what can we do with our courses? What can we do with our labs? particular where students are physically coming into campus and working in labs. Uh, and a lot of us were stuck figuring out how do we ship uh, physical evaluation boards, purchase and ship physical evaluation boards to our students individually across the country, figure out where they are, which we don't necessarily know, and then figure out how to maintain those boards and keep everything working. Right? Well, in some cases, maybe a few people have better ideas, and our award winner tonight was one of those. Uh, we are very pleased to have with us tonight Dr. Ryan Hussein, who is an associate professor and the director of the Remote Hub Lab at the University of Washington. And in response to COVID, Dr. Hussein founded and built the Remote Hub Lab, which is a on-campus physical FPGA lab, where there's FPGA hardware that students can access remotely via the internet. And that allows students to access the FPGA boards, as we know, relatively expensive evaluation boards, avoid having to ship them out individually to students, but still give students the ability to call in, log in, and access those boards, perform their labs, and do their work. Um, the Remote Hub Lab is now a member of a global network that includes at least five universities, two in the country, the University of Washington and the University of Michigan, and also universities in Spain, Indonesia, and Brazil. Um, it was recently awarded the, let's see, the name of the award is the Global Online Laboratory Consortium Award for the best remote laboratory in 2021 that was given by at the 2021 International Conference on Remote Engineering and Virtual Instrumentation. And we are very pleased with us to have tonight Dr. Rani Hussein, who's the winner of the Innovation Award for this year. Okay, so the next award is the RMJ Outstanding Leadership Award. 